Welcome back, you guys, to the Mayanja Accredited News Network. Um, this is going to be a really hard video to make. This is a really hard topic to talk about. Um, the Orlando shooting, the worst mass shooting in American history. Um, I'm purposely not going to mention the shooter's name because I don't think he needs any more airtime than he's already getting. Um, I will tell you that the shooter, he uh, he did work as a security guard. Um, he was a native Floridian. He was investigated twice in 2013 and in 2014 for p possible terrorist um, ties. Um, and he still had the right, he still had, you know, legal authorization to own um, and purchase guns, weapons. Um, so, yeah, I don't really want to spend much time talking about him um i want to talk about what we can do moving forward because this this pain that we feel as americans this horror um it's 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 happening way too often and it's a scary thing to say but it is the truth it is too often that we have to go through this terrible terrible situation of losing people for reasons we might never know because the fact that he did die um the night of the shooting. Huge shout out. My heart goes out to all members, people, persons that are part of the LGBTQ community. It's a horrifying day for Americans, but specifically you. This was a horrendous, horrendous act. And it happened on the week of being proud of who you are. It couldn't be a worse time to attack a community than this past week and the um the victims and the victims families those who are still injured in the hospital recovering and the families of the people who died the 50 the 50 people who got gunned down i can't say much there's nothing i can say that will make anything better um, I do. Um, I will have a link below to a GoFundMe um, that is supporting the victims of the shooting. And I and I ask and I plead with all of you, please send whatever you can. I did. It doesn't matter if it's five dollars, if it's ten dollars, if it's a, a million dollars. Do whatever you can to help them, because this is a hard time. And when hard times come, when you lose someone in your family, the last thing you want to think about is funds. And if this is what we can do, and I. I think it's really all we can do right now. It's guns. It's guns. Guns. I mean, it's everywhere. It's everywhere, and it's, it's too easy. And the guns that are out there are capable of doing such horrific acts. It, 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 it's just it's mind-blowing that it's taking this long for people to understand that, yes, yes, I'm not saying that the guns is what killed the people. Yeah, another person killed someone. But if that guy came in with a, uh, with not an AK-47 or 57, whatever the hell that automatic m gun was, if he came in with a pistol, maybe 10 people would have died. Maybe. Right? Right? But he has an automatic gun. And he's in a club. Uh, if you've ever been in a club, you know it's packed. I mean, you, a minute of just spraying that kills so what I do ask is, I would love it if you guys would just scream at the top of your lungs to all the representatives. Go on Twitter, go on Facebook, I don't care if it's a freaking Snapchat, I want you guys to scream on top of your lungs until change happens. Just all the representatives, your locals, your state government, even President Obama, send a letter, I don't care. Just say gun control, gun control, gun control. I don't care if you're asking for just better background checks. I don't care if you're asking to buy back all the guns in America. Anything until some change happens. Because it is ridiculous and it's disgusting. We need to make a difference and we need to we need something to change so things like this, events like this can never happen again. Thank you. And again, prayers, wishes, thoughts are with the families and the victims. And I really, I pray that something like this never happens again. Because it's, 
it's too often, and chances are it will. Because that's the truth. It will happen if nothing changes. If these kind of guns are still allowed, and it's going to happen if we let things go on the way they are. So let's make the difference. Let's fight. Let's scream until something happens. Thank you.